When was your last visit to a wildlife sanctuary? Still thinking. Time to go. Anyway, let's start. The red squirrel, or Eurasian red squirrel, is a species of tree squirrel in the genus Sciurus common throughout Eurasia. The red squirrel is an arboreal, primarily herbivorous rodent. In Great Britain, Ireland, and in Italy numbers have decreased drastically in recent years. This decline is associated with the introduction by humans of the eastern grey squirrel from North America. However, the population in Scotland is stabilizing due to conservation efforts, awareness and the increasing population of the pine martin, a European predator that selectively controls grey squirrels. Males and females are the same size. The red squirrel is somewhat smaller than the eastern grey squirrel. The long tail helps the squirrel to balance and steer when jumping from tree to tree and running along branches, and may keep the animal warm during sleep. The red squirrel, like most tree squirrels, has sharp curved claws to help it to climb and descend broad tree trunks, thin branches, and even house walls. Its strong hind legs let it leap gaps between trees. The red squirrel also can swim. The coat of the red squirrel varies in color with time of year and location. There are several coat color morphs ranging from black to red. Red coats are most common in Great Britain. In other parts of Europe and Asia different coat colors coexist within populations, much like hair color in some human populations. The underside of the squirrel is always white cream in color. The red squirrel sheds its coat twice a year switching from a thinner summer coat to a thicker, darker winter coat with noticeably larger ear tufts between August and November. A lighter, redder overall coat color, along with the ear tufts and smaller size, distinguish the Eurasian red squirrel from the American eastern gray squirrel. The red squirrel is found in both coniferous forest and temperate broadleaf woodlands. The squirrel makes a dray out of twigs in a branch fork, forming a domed structure about 25 to 30 centimeters in diameter. This is lined with moss, leaves, grass and bark. Tree hollows and woodpecker holes are also used. The red squirrel is a solitary animal and is shy and reluctant to share food with others. However, outside the breeding season and particularly in winter, several red squirrels may share a dray to keep warm. Social organization is based on dominance hierarchies within and between sexes, although males are not necessarily dominant to females, the dominant animals tend to be larger and older than subordinate animals, and dominant males tend to have larger home ranges than subordinate males or females. The red squirrel eats mostly the seeds of trees, fungi, nuts, berries and young shoots. Mating can occur in late winter during February and March and in summer between June and July. Up to two litters a year per female are possible. Each litter averages three young, called kits. Gestation is about 38 to 39 days. The young are looked after by the mother alone and are born helpless, blind, and deaf. Their body is covered by hair at 21 days, their eyes and ears open after three to four weeks, and they develop all their teeth by 42 days. Juvenile red squirrels can eat solids around 40 days following birth, and from that point can leave the nest on their own to find food, however, they still suckle from their mother until weaning occurs at 8 to 10 weeks. Typically a female will produce her first litter in her second year. It was wonderful to see you here, and we will surely catch up soon. Take care.